Hello, hello, I'm Maple Maggie, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Chrono Trigger. Today we're going to go into the cathedral. Um, we found Marl, but now Queen Lean, we know, is missing. So Luca came to this time and um, figured out that Marl is actually Princess Nadia. You can see that in... The last episode, there's a link in the top left corner. These nuns are actually not nuns, as you can see, they're nuggets. I'm just gonna skip through the battle now. So after you fight the Naga Ets, uh, it's fairly simple, but first off, we have to meet our next party member. This is Frog, probably my favorite character in the entire game. And okay, so after you get Frog, uh, it's fairly simple. You just come over to the organ and you play it. And the door will open over on the other side. So once we're in here, there's, there's a bunch of enemies around, um, easy to avoid if you don't want to fight them. Like so, you could just kind of go in a crisscross pattern through the hallway. But I'm actually going to fight them all, so. Uh, the enemies in here are pretty easy. They die in about one one to two hits each, so it's it's not too hard to kill them all. Uh, in here we'll get a maiden suit, a tonic, and an ether. Uh, before I get the last one, we're actually going to go into our menu. Um, and equip Luca with the maiden suit. Equipment. Everybody else seems pretty good. It's just really a Luca. Then over here, find the secret Naga at Bromide. Uh, that will trigger another battle because the enemies will come in uh, trying to uh, accusing you of being after the Bromide, not just taking it for the sake of taking it. So those guys actually had uh, a little less health, but more armor than the other enemies that you'll find in this area. Uh, we're going to want to go to the other side after we equip this new sword to Chrono. Keeping an eye on your health in this uh, area of the game is really important because you don't really have too much of it. So here you can see uh, Queen Lee and the Chancellor. But something seems a little odd about her because she says that there was no need to come rescue her. And they're also talking about a Yakra. We don't really know who that is right now. So when we try to leave, 
they all turn into vipers. So that's another just kind of really easy uh, battle. Uh, but after you beat it, you come over to the right side. You can come around, and there, the the monsters here are singing about Magus, who we also don't really know about, but he seems to be like some sort of god to the monsters. We're thinking. just leave there. There's no battles, but there were those two treasure boxes. Uh, in here is kind of like a, a lunch room for the monsters, I guess. Um, so they, they think that we're in disguise as humans, so we're actually uh, safe in this room. You can talk to the monsters. It's almost my shift. I hate pretending to be human. It's so repulsive. Um, So, uh, yeah, they, they've been eating, they eat humans, uh, which is kind of a typical monster kind of thing to do, uh, you can talk to them or whatever you want to do, um, but also, somewhere there's a which I forget where it is actually. It's not in there. Oh, actually, did I grab the nugget? Yes. Never mind. Oh, right. You just come over to the other side of the spikes there, through the bottom, put them down. You can come right into the room. There's Here you learn that they're hiding the queen in the back, not in that other room where we were, obviously, since... Uh, power tabs are really useful. I don't really use them until later on, because I, I wait until I get the full party and then decide uh, who I want who I want to get stronger. Um, you can avoid all of these enemies... Ex oh, you could avoid them too, but... I usually choose not to skip past too many monsters because it, it just saves you time later on in the game. If you have a hard time uh, fighting anything, you're going to have to level grind, and that's just never any fun for anyone. So there's a treasure box over here that has a shelter in it, which is really useful. Um, over here, there's nothing. So we're just going to go down the stairs on the left, which turns into a slide. We cannot can't get back up that staircase. Um, I'm just gonna fight this guy. After you fight him, you just continue on up through this hallway. Uh, there's a switch here you have to press. That'll just bring in more bats into the room. Um, two treasure boxes here. This paper just says uh, no entry. Obviously there's there's no door so it's kind of hard to enter right now. There's another switch there that will open the, the spikes in this room. So after you fight them, you just, there's a treasure box over here with an iron sword in it which is for frog. So we'll go, we'll just equip that, and uh, you come up to the organ just like last time there was an organ, you play it, and it will open a door. It doesn't really show you where the door is, but I will do that right now. You just come back down this slide, head up through here. I'm going to have to fight these bats because there's four of them now. Uh, they're all pretty easy. Even Luca can one-hit the mad bats. So here's the door that opened uh, when we played the organ. It was the one that said no entry next to it. Uh, try hard enough and you will find a way in. And obviously we have in fact tried hard enough. 
These you can avoid all of them, technically. Uh, I just wanted to get up to the save point. And uh, we'll just head right in. Create yourself Queen Lean. So we're gonna head up here and uh, we see Queen Lean here now. here alive um, and this is a uh, Yakra the guys uh, the guy that the monsters were talking about that we fought last time and the uh, the people in the lunchroom were also talking about this guy and he's he's pretty easy so we're just going to use a couple tech, uh, techs on him. And he, he goes down pretty quickly. Uh, this is really his only big attack that I don't really like putting up with. But it, it is his main source of damage. It attacks all three. So... on Luca and on and then instead of using a tonic uh, you can use slurp for frog uh, slurp will actually just restore almost as much as a tonic so it's it's just as good in my opinion And uh, you don't have to worry too much about uh, conserving your your MP because this is actually the last battle in the area. And that's how easy it is. Uh, I could you should probably make sure that people don't die during this battle, just like in any battle, really, because uh, they won't get experience points if they're dead. However, we have successfully killed Yakra, and Queen Lean has been rescued. Now before we head up there, however, we're going to grab this treasure box, which has the Chancellor in it. 
And over here, there is a mid-eater. There's nothing else in the room, so I'll just go back to the castle. So frog leaves, uh, our main thing that we have to do now, we, uh, now we just have to head up to Queen Lean's room again. Go all the way up the stairs again, and Marl reappears. I would have still showed her around. She's a cute girl. Right, so from here, we just leave the castle and uh, we're gonna head back to the mountain where the portal first appeared. But before I do that, we're gonna talk to Frog. gonna leave the castle and end the video sorry guys uh, stay tuned for the next portion we're gonna go back to 1000 AD and return princess Nadia back to the castle in our own time so thank you for watching please uh, subscribe if you like what you see like the video and I will see you in the next video thank you bye bye